everyone it's a beautiful evening tonight as you can see by the title this video is going to be my self-care routine these are a few things I do when I'm just not feeling 100% mentally spiritually physically and I just want to uplift myself now give this video a thumbs up if you love the great outdoors give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you're not already subscribed as well as turn on your notifications so you know exactly when I've uploaded a video okay sit back and enjoy my self-care routine Whenever I feel I want the ultimate shower or physical cleanse, that involves washing my hair. Recently, I've been using the Shea Moisture Jamaican Black Castor Oil Treatment Mask. I think it's important to keep the scalp feeling breathable and healthy. rinsed out now and it's time to apply my shea butter mix and as always I like to twist my hair so it dries in a stretched state and doesn't need any heat whatsoever face masks feel so good I see them as a way to pamper my skin when it's in need of some TLC. Well, my skin is always in need of TLC, but face masks are like the cherry on top. This is the Aztec Secret Indian Healing Clay. Making a mask with this couldn't be simpler. You just add water. Snack time. I'm gonna rinse it all off now. I find nature walks help me exhale thoughts and feelings that drive me crazy when kept inside. And journaling is part of that expression. Sometimes I'm writing down things I'm grateful for. Sometimes I'm writing down dreams and ideas. Other times I'm just writing down my thoughts and feelings. Do you guys like to journal? I find it quite therapeutic to put pen to paper. Another way I like to take care of myself is by eating well. Offer me a mango and you are speaking my language. I've got some strawberries and mango and pomegranate here. Tasty. An exotic fruit just seems way more appealing as an any time of the day snack. Eating fresh fruit is so important for the body in providing the vitamins and minerals needed. You can eat as abundantly as you wish without feeling bloated after or worrying about how many calories have been consumed. Exercising is the ultimate self-care tool. Engaging in physical activity will leave you feeling the effects days after and those effects will help remind you to keep it going. Your body likes it. Sometimes I can't believe I allowed my lifestyle of fitness to slip but when I get back into it I remember working out isn't something you do on special occasions. It's a lifestyle. It's self-care. I like to take care of myself by drinking tea. This tea isn't the lightest of teas but it's definitely tasty. It's really really aromatic. I usually go for the green, peppermint and fruity teas, but I wanted to try something new. Drinking hot tea almost becomes ceremonial for me because I have to pace myself or get burnt. This tea is a Bengal spice infusion tea and tastes so rich and sweet despite not having any sugar in it. It's a good opportunity to take things slow and stop worrying about things that cannot be controlled. So this has been my self-care routine. Tell me, what do you do to care for yourself? Let me know in the comments. Take care.